West Branch schools still planning to close one of the elementary schools next year. So this evening, Superintendent Tim Saxton held a Facebook Live meeting to explain the plan and answer some questions. First News reporter Jacob Thompson watched the live stream. West Branch's Superintendent Tim Saxton went over the plan to close Knox Elementary School because of enrollment issues. We have lost a significant number of students in our district uh, over the past several years. He showed a slide that compares 2009 and 2010 school year to 2019-2020. It shows enrollment is down 495 kids. Another slide shows the operating cost of all the district schools, with Knox Elementary coming in as the cheapest, with just a little under $500,000. We took a look at, once again, options in terms of building idle, building closure. And at this time, um, we are going to move forward with closing Knox. The plan is to move grades K through 2nd to Damascus Elementary and rename it West Branch Early Learning Center. West Branch's intermediate and middle school will now have preschool and grades 3 through 8. The high school will remain the same with grades 9 through 12. And that will be a, a high school, not a junior, senior high school. The district has a timeline on how they plan to make this happen, with staffing being addressed in April. So there are folks that will stay in the same grade levels or stay in the same positions, but potentially move to another building, and we want to have those conversations. In May, they plan on finalizing building start times and transportation. Saxon says he does not plan to change up routes. He went on to address some rumors and questions that were sent to him, including open enrollment. Open enrollment will not exist. That's false. Um, we rely on our open enrollment students to balance out classes. He went on to say other rumors were false, and we'll have a link to the full slideshow on our website where you can see the plan along where to go to for questions. Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.